Well, whether they were looking for a thrill or looking for a shortcut, that remains unclear. But Metrolinx released this video hoping to underscore the need for safety. Now, it became evident throughout the day that there were a number of points that you could access the tracks from, including over here. They almost didn't get out of the way in time. The heart-stopping moment before a GO train narrowly avoids striking three people in Etobicoke, captured by the train's dash cam. Once they have to go into emergency stop, they don't stop right away. They can take a kilometer to stop. That train crew was barreling down on those children, believing they were going to end their lives in that moment. How traumatizing that is for them. The Milton Line GO train was approaching the Humber River overpass near Dundas Street West. As it traveled, the crew spotted a young person clinging to the fence along the edge of the bridge. Then, after passing them, they saw two more young people running on the track. Miraculously, no one appears to have been hurt. Well, most videos we can't release. Their tragic endings to them. Metrolink says it saw an increase in trespassing incidents during the pandemic. Residents nearby say the tracks are easily accessible from a number of areas. Often we will replace the fence, we'll fix the fence, we'll make the fence bigger. Inevitably, if people are determined to get through there, they will put holes in it again, they will bend it, they will do whatever they can to get through it. Basically from the other trail and this. For BB Rosa. It's not that hidden. Like, what is happening here? This is our pathway. And by seeing that video, I was like, my heart just stopped. So um, I feel scared for the neighbors and the kids. The realization of what happened a short distance from where she lives is still setting in. The reality is that trespassing could net you an up to $5,000 fine, but Metrolink says it's not looking to collect. Instead, they're hoping that the parents or guardians of the people in the video recognize them, reach out, and they can have a conversation about safety. Shalima Maharaj, Global News.